What, what did you just say to me? Uh, I just I see many beautiful ladies in this village. Yeah? Yeah. I didn't notice, huh? Really? <laughs> <laughs> you have no eyes, maybe you're blind. <laughs> guest house right next to the market yeah, nice. right, uh, right along here it's the markets taken up a full block we're in the village of Nong Kai no we're not no we're not Nong Sai, did she say? I don't know. It's down there. Um, we are not in the Muang Fong district anymore. This is Mung Mun. So I'm um, heading straight down to the Sung Tong district, inland from the Lao China Expressway. Lot of rural villages along here. This is the guest house we are staying in. Looks pretty new actually. The outside. Is that it? This one? I don't know. Um, 120,000 a night. Just your basic guest house sort of room. 120 at the moment is seven, just over seven dollars US. About 11 Aussie a night, uh, and that's aircon. Just a quick room tour. We're going to head over the market. It's that time of day when it should be pretty busy over there. Have a look at this town. You want to be careful walking along here, wouldn't you? Oh. Yeah. <laughs> At least the buggers have drainage. We don't in Nong Batong. She's scary, you beautiful. <laughs> she thought I was walking down there. Uh, I'm impressed. I'm impressed and there's not much rubbish in there. We live in a village, Nong Batong and Vientiane, seven to 12 minutes away from the center of town. We don't even have stormwater drainage yet. Got to get your act together, guys. They've got it out here in the villages, in the rural area. Yeah, I near gave this lady a heart attack. She thought I was walking yeah. down there. I didn't see it. <laughs> Good thought. Yeah. <laughs> You're really scary. You will walk. Walk. <laughs> okay. Um, this town. We come from this direction, guys. The last time we came through here, we never seen any part of this town because they do have a big bridge in town and it was being uh, redone, reconstructed, and we had to bypass around into the back streets of the village and missed all this. So uh, we're getting it now. You gotta love these um, 
dirt floor markets, haven't you? Yeah, dirt. Dirt floor. Oh no, that's all right. I I like these traditional dirt floor markets. Got a good vibe about them. There you go. Got your army boots here, Nene. Really? Oh. Yeah. They're actually good boots. These good thick army, soft yeah. sole on them, and good um, grippy tread. My army one. I don't know. You've lost them, have you? Okay. We got real thongs, have we? It's been a while since I've seen real thongs over here. That's okay. That's it. That's it. That's it. Fifty-eight thousand kip, which is about three. US bucks. I know. No, yes, no that's it'll be about it. Yeah. Three US bucks. bucks. Because that's import from Vietnam. That's strong. Vietnam pluggers, are they? <laughs> okay. I don't I haven't seen hats like that in any other markets. It's weird some of the things you come across that you just don't see elsewhere. Oh. 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 Then we have come at a good time of day. Hello, Sabadi. <laughs> oh, scary for <laughs> Really red meat, flesh, isn't it? Easy, <laughs> got a hard scorn, haven't they? Okay. In her village, in Nam Hon. Nam Hon. Nam Hon village. Where's Nam Hon? Yeah. <laughs> uh, up the mountain. Up in the mountains. Mm. Okay. Her neighbor, Han Dai Pai. Han Dai Pai, Laka. Did they invite us up there to drink beer lao? Lava Pa Loki Bia Lao, they never Han Pai. My shout, my yeah, shout. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> uh, no problem there. <laughs> Hello. 
Got a cool marker, hey. They all are. They all. Even though they're, they're all the same, they're all so very different. Okay. It's non high. Oh, it's nowhere near it. What did I say? Nong Sai. It's non high. Very, very friendly. Those girls Nene was talking to, the Mong girls. They've invited us up to their village up in the mountains tomorrow. Nene's got a phone number. We'll see if we can get up there. Hopefully, the weather is kind to us. So the same with this village, is it mainly Hmong people? Yeah. All along this. They have Hmong and they have Yao and Lao Lum live La... together, but Hmong is a lot here. Yeah. How chatty are the people? I'm doing my best. I am, guys. It is, it is so hard taking still shots while trying to vlog. And I, I do appreci appreciate um, the comments. Hello. <laughs> the comments and that for the black and white stills, I think. Hello, Sabadi. Yours on. <laughs> hey, girl got all shy. <laughs> I'll have a look out here. Have a look. Go look at the chicken ladies, hey. Here's the cake lady here. All canoms. Another canom. Smile. <laughs> okay. I like like looking at the markets if you haven't noticed. I, just, I don't really have to say much. I'm just rubbernecking and trying to show you guys as much as possible and hopefully you're just taking it all in without me having to describe anything it's half the time I don't even know what I'm looking at bloody insect just flew straight into my eye I'm pretty sure it was a chilly insect because it burnt like hell when it hit me <laughs> <laughs> it did oh, insect, that insect was on fire the older ladies love getting their photos taken have you noticed they're the young ones they'll, they'll see the camera and cover their mouth and walk away hear that for long. Okay. Now we're getting up into the good section, eh? Hey? They've got Mong knives, but they're just those Chinese bloody mass produced things. They're not the good homemade Mong master knives now that's something different it's like a plane is it it's just shaven haven't seen those around before it's a baby oh, and cowbells cowbells Okay, cup J. Yeah, none of that's really um, homemade by a local blacksmith or anything. 
not like the dude up in um, near Luang Prabang on your way to Kuangzi Falls. These are the same. It is do a dying art, isn't it? You can tell when they're in these coloured ones, they're just all the mass produced ones. I've looked at them thousands of times, guys. I'm not going to do it again. Hello, Sabadi. Baby. <laughs> to look a surprise on them when they look up and see a farang, eh? We'll have a sticky beak out on the road, get our bearings, see what's out here. two hats there. He has got two hats on. Getting on, the old lady's the, the old lady is getting on. There you go. Karaoke started. Walk her down along the back street, eh? Yeah. Hanahan. 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 restaurant. Nene's just inquiring about it now. I hope they're not guiding us to that loud karaoke one. Can you hear it? Can you hear it? Loud karaoke. It's a fat looking chicken. That's not a mountain chook. I never really noticed, but Nene just said it. There's many beautiful ladies here. <laughs> she said it, so it's okay for me to point it out now. What, what did you just say to me? Many beautiful lady in this village. Yeah? Yeah. I didn't notice, huh? Really? <laughs> <laughs> you have no eyes, maybe you're blind. <laughs> they are everywhere. They are. They are. I'm speechless. It's just they are. They are everywhere. The long ladies here, very attractive. The children everywhere. Yeah, a lot of children. And they are praying. Lots of big cars. Lots of big cars. They're do, doing well. Hello. Uh, big, car and big, car. big cars, big houses. Doing good business here. <laughs> it's so much, much easier to get to now with this sealed road, guys. Last time we were up here, it was a bog. And it easy. took us nearly a full day to get from the sun time into Muang Kuang. But now Sealed Road, great place to come and explore. More beautiful Lao um, Mong ladies. And the salon here. I have salon here. So I can do it tomorrow. You can go to the salon while I sleep in, hey? Hello, Subadi. 
สิพากันไปใส่มาเมื่อเฮือนบ่มาเอาเมาส์บมีมาเอายังมาซิเมาส์ได้ละ We just done a full loop of the block. There's our guest house there, and this is our. Got a fruit and veg lady right out here. Hey, girl. Always looks so good. This one's different, eh? It actually looks longer than the others I've seen of this variety. Still got the same sort of motor as the long ones, long handled ones, Bill. Really. Would be much easier to drive than those ones that bloody Chris has, but. You usually see these ones loaded up with about 20 people on them going to work and coming home. I'd say this is where the lady was guiding us to the restaurant. We'll walk up here first, have a look before we, we lose light. No doubt we're going to get more vision of this city, well, city town tomorrow. But we're going to visit those Mongols tomorrow, aren't we? The, yeah. pr the pretty Mongols. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, I got the best wife ever. Mm -hmm. Organising that, hey? Yeah. yeah. And she asked, uh, you asked about beer. She is it's okay. Oh, that's but right. We to we're going to have to take some beer now. <laughs> <laughs> I want to check out these tractors. Be some people interested in checking out these tractors. Just got to whack one of those motors on it that we just were checking out on that other one. And your own seat. But ready to go. Oh no. What have we got over here? A little bit of a buffet happening over here. Okay. Viva. <laughs> phone shops you'll see them everywhere you'll see them in the most isolated village ever oh barber shop Wow, there's just so much going on, and just it, what's throwing me is seeing a sealed road in amongst old traditional buildings like this. You know, it was just potholes on that last time we come through well I don't as I said I don't remember coming through this part of town because of the bridge being out I, I think the bridge is still this way but we went around the, the village coming out up the top of the hill up here I'm sure of it what have we got here what have we got cooking oh how about that pork those ribs there Always smell so good this stuff. Right, uh, I'll have a bit of bit of a look around the sites and that tomorrow of this village, big village. 
of Nan Hai bus stop there. Borkham restaurant just here. Pretty sure that's how you say it. And okay, there's another one tucked up here too. The menu there and in English. There you go. Very helpful. <laughs> These plastic ones are more comfortable. Okay. Yeah, I can lounge more on them. That one has 37% on it. Pretty sure that'll be seeing both of us. 30%? 37%. It's probably down to 36% now. I was it's just saying really Nene wasn't doing her job properly today. I've gone through all my three batteries and I wondered why I went through them so quick. But <laughs> usually when we're driving, we've got the, the charger in the console with the battery always on there. So we have videoed a bit today. So nook nook guys, this is it. I'm ordered pad kapow. Nothing any different. One beer tonight. What did you order? Uh, for stream. Stream for... Uh, like a pork, stew, stew pork. Did, did you ask these girls if we can drive a car to her village? Is it we won't get bogged or she's got no, it? I will ask her later. The young Mong girls, well, they're of drinking age, aren't they? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> uh, yeah we're going to call them tomorrow, so see if I um, get out there and, and see you take us. A tour too. Tour? Yeah. Oh cool. That'll be that'll be fun. Yeah. That'll be fun. So that's it. My batteries are nearly very, gone. So very I'm calling the quits girl. quits for today. We'll see you. Just see her in the market. But very friendly. Did she start talking to you or you started talking? I start to asking. And she was just very friendly. Yeah, very really friendly. And she just oh if you want to do it, just come with me. Just follow me, just something like okay. that. Oh, that's good. That's great. That's why I asked her number. Okay, we will. Because if we travel in the village like this, we have to know the local people. Yeah, yeah. It's yeah. that's it's why we go to a lot of markets. Is because <laughs> when you go to a new place, you don't know where all these other good things are. So it's always good to get to know local people. Then they take you to the good places. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, and you know the story. Every you village has a well. market, so that's why we usually go there. It's, it is interesting to look at. Yeah. Yep, yep. Anyway, guys, that's it. Uh, see you tomorrow. Well, angels flutter around her heart. Love can hear, they softly call. When trouble comes to the ones she loves, her angels come. They ease all suffering, they heal all pain. Her angels come like healing rain. Love and angels conquer all like rain. Her healing angels fall. Love and angels conquer all. Her healing angels, they softly call amen. You call it truth. And call a war, everyone is a bastard, everyone is a whore, everyone is a saint, everyone is redeemed, and everyone is at the mercy of another one's dream. Oh, she is a suffering, heals all pain, her angels come like healing rain. Love and angels conquer all like rain, her healing angels fall. Love and angels conquer all. Her healing angel softly call him man. Are kings, I got nervous. I 
about what dark brain.